A major turning point has just been marked in the aviation world. The European Union Aviation Safety Agency has officially certified a bold new variant of the Rolls-Royce Trent XWB-84 engine, dubbed the XWB-84EP, specially developed for the Airbus A35900. Rolls-Royce claims this upgrade represents a significant leap in fuel efficiency for the wide-body segment. So, just how superior will this version be? How will it power the A350 to dominate the wide-body segment? Let's find out. The unveiling of the Trent XWB84 EP by Rolls-Royce comes at a time when competition in the aircraft engine market is reaching new levels of intensity. Industry giants like Pratt and Whitney and CFM International are racing to deliver next-generation advances in fuel efficiency and engine durability, all vying for a larger share of the highly lucrative wide-body segment. In this high-stakes landscape, every breakthrough matters, and Rolls-Royce has just made its move. The market response to this upgrade has been nothing short of exciting. A recent order from Egypt Air for 12 additional Trent XWB84 engines, geared towards supporting its expanding long-haul fleet, stands as a strong vote of confidence. Industry analysts believe that Rolls-Royce's bold push could trigger a wave of competitive upgrades, forcing rival manufacturers to accelerate their own innovation programs in an effort to hold on to market share. So, just how good is this upgrade, really? Rolls-Royce boldly calls the Trent XWB84 the world's most efficient large aero engine, and there's strong evidence to back that claim. The engine already offers a staggering 25% reduction in fuel burn and carbon emissions compared to older generation engines. That puts it at the forefront of the commercial aviation sector at a time when environmental performance is no longer a luxury. It's a requirement. But Rolls-Royce wasn't satisfied with just that. Despite the Trent XWB84's current dominance, the company believes the engine still needs to be improved further. That's the driving force behind the new EP, Enhanced Performance, package. It reflects a relentless commitment to innovation, an attitude of never being satisfied, even when you're leading. And that mindset is now taking shape in their push toward a more sustainable future. All the things the EP supplies might be something you never saw coming. Rolls-Royce believes that the upgraded Trent XWB84 EP incorporates a series of groundbreaking enhancements that elevate the already high-performing engine to an entirely new level. The company claims these upgrades further strengthen the Trent XWB's industry-leading reliability while improving fuel efficiency and reducing environmental impact. Specifically, the EP variant is said to achieve at least a 1% reduction in fuel consumption, which could translate into average annual fleet fuel savings of around $5 million. According to Rolls-Royce, this improvement not only helps lower carbon dioxide emissions and operating costs, but also results in quieter operations by as much as two decibels without compromising the engine's durability. You might wonder, what difference can just 1% in fuel burn really make? But in the context of wide-body long-haul operations, it's not simple. That single percentage point translates into millions of dollars in fuel savings every year per fleet and significantly reduced emissions, a golden metric in today's sustainability-driven airline industry. Notably, a key element of this future is sustainable aviation fuel, SAF. Rolls-Royce highlights that the Trent XEWB84 EP is already certified to operate with SAF blends of up to 50%. But their ambitions go further. They're actively working toward full compatibility with 100% SAF, a bold step that would make the engine not just efficient, but transformational. In a world inching toward net zero emissions, this could become a critical differentiator. Let's continue, but wait up. Thanks for sticking around until here. Please show your support by hitting like, sharing, and don't forget to subscribe to get notified about our super interesting videos. Thanks a lot. In addition, durability also remains a cornerstone. As the powerhouse behind Airbus's long-haul A350 fleet, the Trent XWB84 must perform reliably for thousands of hours in some of the harshest conditions in aviation. These engines often spend more time in the air than on the ground, and they simply cannot afford to fail. 
That's why Rolls-Royce didn't take shortcuts. The development and certification of the EP variant included one of the most extensive testing programs in the company's history, with eight development engines and three flight test units logging thousands of hours before certification was achieved in December. Yet, the Trent XWB84 EP is not without its challenges, especially when placed next to its fiercest competitor, the GE9X. According to publicly available data, the GE9X remains roughly 4% more fuel efficient than the upgraded XWB84 EP. It also boasts premium features like composite fan blades and a FOD filter for core protection, technologies that give GE an edge, at least on paper. For perspective, GE claims the GE9X is about 5% more efficient than its closest rival which has traditionally been the Trent XWB-97. So even with the EP upgrade boosting performance by 1%, the GE9X still appears to lead the fuel efficiency race by a noticeable margin. And when combined with its next-generation design elements, this advantage cannot be ignored. So where does that leave the Trent XWB-84 EP? It may not be the undisputed king in every category, but it's an engine that represents the perfect blend of reliability, efficiency, and forward-looking sustainability. And in the high-stakes game of wide-body aviation, that makes it a serious contender not just for today, but for the future of flight. Still, even with the operational advantages this upgraded engine promises, Rolls-Royce isn't completely in the clear. Challenges in the aftermarket sector, particularly around lingering tariff uncertainties, continue to cast a shadow. But there's reason for optimism. Recent progress in trade negotiations has started to ease some of those concerns, with the U.S. pledging to drop its proposed 10% base tariff on UK-built Rolls-Royce engines under a promising new trade framework. It's a much-needed boost just as the company prepares to shake up the wide-body engine race once again. As airlines place increasing emphasis on efficiency and sustainability, the certification of the Trent X WB84 Enhanced Performance EP variant strategically positions both Rolls-Royce and Airbus to better address the evolving demands of the aviation industry. This development is more than just a technical upgrade. It's a timely response to the shifting priorities of airline operators who are under growing pressure to reduce emissions, optimize fuel use, and meet ambitious environmental targets. In this context, the XWB84 EP emerges not just as a refined engine, but as a strategic tool that aligns operational performance with long-term sustainability goals. Moreover, the ripple effects of this enhancement extend beyond the engine itself. It intensifies the ongoing competition among top engine manufacturers, all of whom are racing to offer more advanced, fuel-efficient, and environmentally friendly propulsion systems for the wide-body aircraft market. By raising the performance bar, Rolls-Royce is essentially prompting rivals like GE and Pratt and Whitney to accelerate their own innovation timelines, pushing the industry as a whole toward faster technological advancement. One particularly intriguing question is whether the upgrades introduced in the XWB84 EP could eventually be applied to its more powerful sibling, the Trent XWB97, which powers the Airbus A350000. If so, it could mark a pivotal moment for customer interest, especially from high-profile carriers like Emirates, which have previously voiced concerns about performance and engine efficiency in this segment. A re-engagement from Emirates, especially if the engine upgrades align with their operational and environmental ambitions, could reshape market dynamics and breathe new life into Airbus's long-haul strategy. Looking even further ahead, Industry observers are speculating about what power plant will be chosen for Airbus's next-generation wide-body aircraft, potentially a stretched or re-engineered version of the A350-1000. In that scenario, will Rolls-Royce once again be the front-runner with an evolved version of the XWB line, or will it be an opportunity for Rolls-Royce's competitors to step into the spotlight. What's clear is that the wide-body segment is entering a dynamic and potentially disruptive phase. The convergence of tightening regulatory pressure, mounting environmental urgency, 
and rapid technological progress is fueling a new era of innovation, and the engines driving these aircraft will be central to that transformation. Recent incidents, such as the Air India Boeing 787 accident, have reignited concerns over the long-term reliability and safety of certain aircraft platforms. This, in turn, could open the door wider for alternatives like the Airbus A350, powered by the Trent XWB series, aircraft and engines that have consistently demonstrated high performance, reliability, and environmental credibility. The emergence of the Trent XWB84 EP may well mark just the beginning of a far broader and far more exciting shift in the future of long-haul air travel.